Hello and welcome to News Pulse. I'm Naomi Kikon. Now the news in detail. Recently, the Marlborough Municipal Council warned the public against animal cruelty. In regard to this, DMC, in collaboration with Veterinary Department, the Marlborough Police and Society for Prevention of Cruelty to Animals, conducted a surprise check at supermarket de Mabur for the illegal sale of dogs. To know more about this, Ormbil TV spoke with SPCA and NOAA's ARC member Imlisen. She informed that as soon as they reached for the surprise check in the market, the sellers who were illegally selling dogs fled the scene. First of all, it was initiated by SPCA Dimapur in collaboration with uh, Dimapur Police, DMC and the Veterinary Department. So, uh, Dr. Zuben from the Veterinary Department. Okay. He was a part of the patrol and uh, Ma'am Sentila from DMC. Mm. Okay. And uh, the Mapo Police and yeah, the SPCA members uh, around uh, around uh, seven of us from SPCA. Okay. So, so did, yeah. did you uh, you know like rescue any dogs? So actually, since this was our first ever surprise. Uh, patrol, I mean, surprise visit, we decided that we will just warn them of the consequences this time. And uh, so we just uh, educated and sort of uh, let the vendors know of uh, the Cruelty PCA Act, mm. that uh, selling of dogs, like with their mouths tied or being sold in the sacks where like they're cruelly treated or sometimes, you know, uh, some dogs even suffer and they die, right? So such practices mm. are illegal, is what we uh, educated the vendors on. And yeah, uh, so there was a puppy. Was, so when we reached the spot, almost all the vendors, they fled. They were not there. Okay. Okay. So, but then we, uh, we saw a puppy which was tied with a uh, plastic rope, okay? So, yeah, we educated the vendor and let her know that uh, this shouldn't be repeated again. And we, of course, we did not rescue that puppy. We just warned her this time. Okay. So, uh, can yeah. you tell us uh, earlier, like you have spoken about the act that is uh, given for the safety of uh, yeah. animals. Can you please tell us more about the act and the penalty that comes under that? So, uh, Prevention of Cruelty Against Animals Act 1960, it's called uh, PCA Act 1960. So, as per this, there are, uh, there are a lot of laws. Actually, this law applies not only just for dogs and uh, cats, or but this applies for all all the animals, okay? So, uh, as per the law, you uh, what we are emphasizing right now is like you cannot... Uh, we cannot dictate someone's food habits, but when dogs are being sold in the middle of the road, tied up in sacks, you know, you know uh, under such scorching heat, these are illegal and these are, uh, this is, uh, you know, uh, against the PCA. These are all written uh, uh, against the law uh, under the PCA uh, Prevention of Cruelty Act 1960. So, yeah. uh, the next time you go, you will be rescuing uh, dogs? Yes, we will be confiscating the dogs. Okay. And we have a shelter in Burma Camp, Burma Camp Dimapur. So, we will be confiscating the dogs and we will be putting them, up in, the uh, putting them in the shelter and they will be up for adoption. In 2020, the DMC, in compliance to the state government order on dog meat ban, and in accordance to the provision of the FSS Act 2006 and FSS Regulations 2011, commercial import and trading of dogs and dog markets and slaughtering and commercial sale of dog meat in markets and dining restaurants was banned within the jurisdiction of the Mopur Municipal Council. Any person found violating this order shall be liable to be punished under section 428 and 429 of Indian Penal Code 1860 and section 11 of the Prevention of Cruelty to Animals Act 1960 and or any such other provision of law as may be applicable.